guys, it's your girl Sydney and I'm back with another video. So I figured today a lot of you guys have requested, you guys always ask me what kind of bras I wear because I am a little bit curvier, thicker, plus size. And I figured, you know what, I'm gonna share that. I hope this helps you guys out, whether you are watching this for yourself, you're watching this for your wife, you're watching this for your girlfriend, you're watching it because, you know, you just wanna know. I hope this helps you. There's gonna be some try on. This video is probably gonna be demonetized because of this, but I just wanna do it to help you guys out. So, with that being said, I get all my bras from Victoria's Secret. I'm 36, triple D. And I usually wear an XL in underwear, um, so that's like my sizing. I'm 5'9". So first, I wanted to show you guys this haul, but then all of these are a 36 triple D. And um, the style I'll read to you of the bras, because there's two styles that I'm like obsessed with. Or maybe there's three. There's three styles in this haul that I get all the time. And... Um, the other thing is like when you do have a bigger chest your bras do not stay the same way that like they would if you have like an A cup and this is what I've realized with myself at least like my bras last me probably two months and maybe three or four if I'm not wearing them as often but I usually I wear a nude one so I have a nude one on underneath right now and then I have a black one and then I have a, another lace one that's like not this style but it's like this style but different and it has different like side on it and everything the other one has like little locks on it but with this the biggest thing that I can say is you have to find bras that fit you and if they don't fit you or you get colors that are gonna show like sweat stains or if you if they're white they might show pit stains or like anything just make sure you buy bras that either you're gonna wear less often or you're gonna have um, like wash it a decent amount and I usually always hand wash my bras so yeah so a little bit of background I am over the age of 18 I am 5'9 36 triple D I wear an XL in underwear and then I usually wear a large and extra large in tops and then um, bottoms I'm usually extra large as well just because I like to pull it up to my waist so this is kind of what my body looks like sitting I have like a smaller waist but um, I st like I still have a tummy if you know what I mean so with that being said let's get into this haul I'm gonna try a couple of these things on so you can see how they look on me if you're interested in getting any of them I think I can find the links and I'll have them in the description box so first we're gonna get into the ones that don't have any padding because I think those ones are fun and cool and you know I like them. I feel like they're very flattering though. In all honesty, these ones, I have, a, I have it in black, so I decided when they had the sale, because I got these for like $10, I was like, you know what, let's just get this because I know that I like these and there's no padding whatsoever and my boobs literally just fill it so nicely. So this is in a 36 triple D, so it's my normal size. It just fits differently because there's no padding. There's a little lining right here just to hold your boob up but it's not like padded or anything um but your nipples do show through this and it is laced so i have it in this color which is like a pinky color like a pinky mauve and it is a hand wash only so you have to like hand wash it this is the dream angels push up without padding just so you guys know and it is in a 36 triple D, but it doesn't say the color. But it looks like this. It's like a pinky one. The detailing right here is glittery at the top. I'm obsessed with this. I have this one in like an orangey color as well, but um, it's not the unpadded kind. So that's why I got it in this style. So I have that one in the unlined. Then I also have a nude one, but it has a pink tone to it. So I'm obsessed with this. This one was also around $10. I got it on the semi-annual sale though, online, because I can never find my size in the stores. And it's the same thing. This one is also the Dream Angels Push Up Without Padding. And it has three hooks in the back just because um, I'm pretty sure it's just the bigger your cups are, the higher your cup sizes are, the um, more hooks you get. But yeah, this one you can definitely tell has a little bit of wear and tear on it, probably because it was just sitting in the warehouse forever. The tags are still on it though. And then 
This one is in a white, and I just thought this was pretty. It's also the Dream Angels, unlined, unpadded, three hooks hand wash only so this one I have to I have to remember that these ones are hand wash only but I always hand wash my bras anyway so getting into it then I also have this which is a lilac purpley color this has hella hooks but it's a 36 triple D as well and it's just beautiful the floral like lacy pattern on it is just gorgeous there's a little bit of lining but there's no padding on this one and the back says what it is so it's the body by Victoria line demi double so if you're wondering that's the style of this one that's really pretty then I also have another one and this one is actually a halter styled bralette and this is in black they also come in maroon and this was during the holidays but I got it during the semi-annual sale and it just has a ton of detail on it if you can see this one's totally unlined and unpadded but it's just cute and fun I definitely cannot wear this very often though it is an extra large and it's called the very sexy bralette and it has four hooks on this one but I think it's really pretty so I'm definitely not against it I just know that there's no support coming from it because there's no actual underwire so if you do have a bigger chest though I would highly recommend getting things that have wire those are the ones the, this is the only thing I think that I got that does not have wire in it bra wise but that was just because it was on sale and I tried it on in the store and I just saw it was on sale online so I was like okay I can I can get this so now we're gonna get into all the bras that I'm obsessed with and I can tell you guys right now um, I've tried a lot of bras and if you have a bigger chest these ones are the most like comfortable for your boobs and they're like the size of my face oh my god <laughs> But they're the most comfortable and they're the most like make your boobs naturally look perky and they're not like up here to your chest because for me personally like I like to look more natural I don't like the look where your tits are all the way up to your chin so with that being said and then after that I'm gonna show you underwear um we're gonna go with the ones that are less padded so these ones are my favorite I think these are body by, by Victoria but we're gonna look up these are all 36 triple D as usual but I just want to clarify that so yeah these are the body by Victoria perfect shape I'm obsessed with these I have these in like a lot well I don't have a lot of them but I've gone through a lot of them because I usually have like two bras at a time this is the most amount of bras I've ever had at a time ever in my life but I just the semi-annual sale was too good to pass up and I had some coupons and stuff that were like good deals so I was like okay let's get it but this is the red this has three hooks in the back very very pretty the cups hold up very very well and you can also unclip right here so I like this style a lot I think it's very comfortable it has padding but it doesn't have push-up so if you're wondering there is not push-up in it there's just padding so it's just lined with padding so your nipples don't get hard it holds the girls up and it looks very natural these ones are not meant to be like tits to your chin type style but there's a really cute bow on it I'm obsessed with this style and I love red because red makes me just feel good about myself and I have a I like try to pick out basic bras that will match with basic underwear so my underwear and bra usually matches I didn't get them at Victoria's Secret because you don't need to get your underwear from there like I mean at least for me I just get nice underwear that I like that's all different colors so I can just match them with my Victoria's Secret bras so I have it in red there's a cute little bow I'm really really obsessed with this style I just think it's perfect and it's kind of glittery in certain points then I have it in white which looks like this if it'll focus probably won't focus but that's okay yeah see that's what it looks like then I also have it in this plum color very pretty I think this is a really pretty color it makes you feel good and it makes you feel like slim thick you know the white is just gonna get dirty so I probably won't wear that very often and then there's just like this nudish color one just so I can wear it with like white t-shirts and black t-shirts and you know I just wear it and it does have a cute little bow still so those four are the they're 36 triple D but they're called the body by Victoria perfect shape so if you're wondering this one is definitely one of my favorites for natural um, like lift without having like a ton of push-up 
they feel super soft too which is why i love them i'm kind of obsessed with them but then my friends are like say come on don't get more and little do they know online shopping happened this time now is the holy grail of push-up bras so if you guys don't know when you have bigger boobs not for everyone but for me I feel like my boobs are grandma boobs. I mean, they're not super low. You can probably find it on the internet what they look like, but <laughs> but like they definitely for my age are lower because they're very natural and I lost a lot of weight. I gained a lot of weight. I lost a lot of weight. And so my boobs just didn't have time to bounce back. So this is the bra that I'm wearing right now. This is what it looks like in a shirt with cleavage. I got multiple basic colors and then I got two that I feel like are more on the fun side. I have it in nude already, which is what I'm wearing right now, but I decided, you know what, treat myself because I love this bra because first of all, my boobs actually fit it. Second of all, I can wear it and it's not obnoxious push up. So if you guys see what it looks like on me right now, like I could button this and you would never be able to know, but when it comes off, I feel good about myself and my own skin. So that's why I got that. This is the first one in this style. Now I'm going to read you what it is. So it's a 36 triple D as I've been saying a million times. In this video but it's a very sexy push-up so when you guys are looking for these bras I would highly recommend to go into Victoria's Secret if you haven't been fitted in a while try on the bras see which one fits the best ask the girl there for her opinion let her see what your cleavage looks like what your boobs look like because at the end of the day like they will give you an honest answer I went in there and I had a double D a 36 double D thinking that like it fits so well. Little did I know my nipples were popping out and she was like, honey, you really need to size up. And I, I didn't, I didn't realize it cause I've been wearing that same bra for so long. And um, now for like about a year I've been wearing this, but I got it in black because black goes with everything. And it's so versatile. And it does have this really cute little charm on the side, which is like a nice little feature, but it doesn't ever show up in anything. And it has like a little diamond on the side or like a crystal thing. Then there's this one, which is like a gray color. This is called the Very Sexy Push Up as well. And then I got it in white. And I just figured, you know what? It doesn't hurt to have a white bra because I do wear white t-shirts sometimes and nude doesn't, depending on the white, it doesn't always look right. So that also has a really cute little gem and this one is actually not gold it's actually silver and i just think it's really pretty it's very crisp white and i own white underwear so it like works out all of these are 36 triple d this is the very sexy push-up those are the normal ones that don't have any like gems or lace or anything then there's this bad boy this one is so pretty and it's just lacy it's a lot less comfortable than the other ones but it's also very comfortable like um it just depends on how you feel and react to different lace because the top has like a little bit of lace right here the side is what i love it just has so much detailing on it if you can't see and this one does have three hooks the other one has i think two yeah and these ones have three so it gives you a little bit more of like support in the back cage area and this one's also the very sexy push-up just a different pattern and stuff so if you order online it's in there you just have to find the one that has this pattern but I'm obsessed with it I think it's really pretty and very sexy you can wear black underwear with it or you can wear nude and it's just I think it's very pretty like the detailing on the side is just gorgeous so there's that one and then there's this maroon plum color go ASU just kidding I don't think that's even like gonna work for ASU but it has little like rivets that are bronze at the bottom and I'm obsessed because it's just a little bit of detail but enough and I can wear this and it's not going to show but it's going to make me feel good. So now we're going to get into underwear which is the last thing on the list. I bought four pairs of underwear, three of which have sparkles, the other one just has shimmer. So we'll start with that one first. I used to, I have a favorite brand, uh, favorite style of underwear that they discontinued so I was really surprised when I saw this because this is really similar to the back of the other underwear which was like called Modella. And it looks like this so if you guys ever see underwear from there link it to me tweet it to me whatever and you'll see like the back peephole with like the little bow is my favorite and it's just very flattering on me but the first one that I got was this pink one and it looks like that shimmery and it just looks like this and I'm obsessed this one I think 
was like 650 which isn't bad for Victoria's Secret underwear and it does last a while which is what I like um, and it makes you feel so good about yourself then going on that this one's sparkly though it is so sparkly and pretty it just blinds you you know do you see that and it's very soft and this is also on sale these are both XL the other two are XL and it fits very well at that point. Like I can wear a large, but I like to be able to not have a muffin top. So that's why I get that size. <laughs> then I showed you this earlier. It's very sparkly, pretty, has a charm on the back and on the front. There's a star in the front and then a little moon in the back. And then last but not least, kapow! There's this, which is super bright. It's orange. Look at that shimmer. There's a star on the front and a little moon in the back. Now you can see it. But that is everything that I got from Victoria's Secret. I hope that I could help you out with deciding, getting things for your lady, getting things for yourself. Just remember that, you know, you don't definitely don't need all of these bras, but these are the ones that I really like. These are the colors that I purchased and you know, there's tons of ways to save money on Victoria's Secret, so just keep on the lookout when they have deals, save those reward cards and actually use them like I do and get size so you're not wasting money on bras that don't actually fit you but with that being said i hope that you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to like comment subscribe follow me on instagram follow me on snapchat and go follow me on twitter if you want to if you guys are interested in any of my content that is not okay for youtube you can click my website down below and check it out or my only fans or anything else it'll all be linked down below for you guys and I hope that you guys are having a great day, and I'll see you guys in my next video. If you guys have any video requests, leave them down below, and I will see you guys later. Bye. Peace out, Girl Scout.